This is very simple. But do know how does it work. If not, then come with me. This lock can be opened only by a particular key. If you try a different key, you will not be able to open it. So let's see what is inside this lock and how does it work. Here you can see 5 channels drilled on the surface and each channel consists 3 parts. These are the key pins. The length of the key pin varies according to the pattern of the key. Above each key pins we have driver pins. All of them have the same length and each driver pin is loaded by a spring. The pins can slide freely along the channel. Springs push down the pins into this plug and this plug can freely rotate only if the gap between each of the key pins and driver pins coincides with this line. This line is called shear line. This object restricts the shackle to get out of the lock. When the plug rotates, the object moves and the shackle becomes free and get out of the lock. Now see how the key make it possible to open the lock. When the key is inserted, it pushes all the pins upward and make the gap between pins coincide with the shear line. And now the plug is free to rotate. Now rotating the key will rotate the plug and the shackle will get out of the lock. Now see why the wrong key fails to do this. On inserting it, it can't align the gap between pins along the shear line. So the pins restrict the plug to rotate. As a result, it's impossible to open it. So this is all about lock. My next video will be on master key. Thank you.